Hi, everyone. My name is Irvin Guerra, and I am on the product marketing team here at Gigamon. It's very nice to meet you. In this short video, I will show you how you can gain visibility into the traffic between containers and show you how to send this access intelligence to your various tools. I don't think it's much of a secret that accessing the traffic communicating between containers is pretty difficult to do. Regardless of the difficulty, it is essential for you to have this visibility in an effort to eliminate all the possible blind spots you may have for your security and performance monitoring postures. The solution I'll be showing today not only presents a way in which you can efficiently access this source of intelligence, but it also enables you to deliver this traffic to tools effectively. Without further ado, let's dive in. Here we see Gigamon Fabric Manager. This is the place where you can configure all the different sources you access traffic from and also configure the policies of where you want to send the traffic. FM allows you to ingest intelligence from various different sources across your entire infrastructure, including these right here. For today, let's take a look at how you can gain access to traffic between containers. To access traffic between containers, we use something called a universal cloud tab or UCT for short. A UCT can be thought of as a visibility point that is used to access traffic between containers, pods, or nodes across all virtual environments, which, as you can imagine, makes implementation dramatically easier since you're using the same product to tap into traffic across all these areas. Gigamon Fabric Manager also offers what's called ATS, or Automatic Target Selection. ATS automatically detects and provides visibility into new nodes, pods, containers, hosts, etc., as they pop in and out of existence in virtual environments. A combination of UCTs and ATS help ensure complete visibility without blind spots as your infrastructure evolves to meet various business needs, allowing you to scale and make modifications with confidence knowing visibility blind spots won't be created. Ultimately, this is how our customers ensure visibility in the lateral traffic that does not cross firewalls in virtual environments. For containers specifically, a UCT would sit within a Kubernetes node, accessing all the traffic between containers and the traffic leaving and entering the node. This is different from native capabilities that sit outside of the node and only access the traffic leaving and entering the node itself. Here we can see the three UCTs sitting within nodes on AWS, capturing the traffic between containers and the UCT controller that is aggregating the traffic from these three nodes and sending this traffic to the configured destination. As for sending the traffic that's been accessed, configuring the destination is also extremely easy to do. When customizing a policy, there's a couple of things that you can do. Under source selectors, you can choose what sources we want to include in this specific policy. You can set your parameters as wide as all the traffic across all UCTs currently running, or as narrow as the traffic from a specific container. Under rules, you can choose whether you want to access the traffic ingressing, egressing, or both from the sources you've identified, and deploy is to launch the policy and begin flowing the customized intelligence policy to various tools. The ability to customize the policy to fit your specific needs is a critical component for analyzing traffic. Not only do we help you access the traffic that is communicating between containers, but we also help you only send the traffic you need rather than a broad export of data extracted from outside the node. Once your policy has been deployed, flowing the traffic to tools is easy to do. Let's take a look. Here we see an example of a monitoring session that is set up to send the intelligence from the container policy we just looked at to the various tools that you may have. The traffic from the container policy comes in the form of complete raw packets. If you would like to optimize the traffic before it reaches the tool, you can easily do so by dragging and dropping different capabilities into the flow, like deduplication, load balancing, or packet slicing and connecting the various blocks to each other to create your own customized flow. Adding a tool to your flow is just as easy to do. To summarize what we just went over, we saw how you can easily set up, gain visibility into your containers and send critical intelligence to your tools. Gaining visibility into containers through Gigamon is easy to accomplish helps you minimize the time it takes to gather the intelligence needed, supports troubleshooting efforts, and simply eliminates the blind spot of east-west traffic that is traveling from container to container within a pod. If there are any questions, please feel free to contact us here at Gigamon for more information.